At 3 a.m. on a cold January morning, a quadcopter invaded the grounds of the White House, undetected by systems at the White House designed to protect the President and the First Family. The Secret Service admits that this quadcopter was undetected by their radar. This couldn't be stopped with radar jamming devices easily as well, as it, radar jamming devices would likely cause disturbances to air traffic in the immediate area around Washington. Another problem with shooting this down was you have to be able to see it to shoot it, and therefore it was hard to detect. But the White House was protected, as evidenced by the damage to the helicopter and the damage visible on the ground around it. Visible in the photograph are leaves of an American holly tree and the telltale signs of the holly tree is also there. It is the red berries of the holly tree. So we can thank a landscaping around the White House for helping defend the White House Landscaping is used a lot of places to help defend you. It can keep neighbors from prying in and seeing what you're doing. It can be a defensive mechanism now against quadcopters. So if you want to see more about quadcopters, watch the rest of this video as we describe in detail the use and operations of a quadcopter. Hi, I'm Brian Chrisman. Uh, my phone number is 484-240-4478. Um, this is the drone that I use to uh, videograph uh, houses for real estate agents. Uh, for anybody that would like aerial pictures, uh, it does high definition video, 14 megapixel uh, pictures, uh, both in JPEG and RAW format. Uh, this is uh, the model is the uh, DJI uh, Phantom. Uh, it's a fully stabilized uh, camera system, uh, fully motorized and GPS coordinated. So no matter how far uh, you twist side or side, the camera will stay stabilized. Uh, so your video doesn't need to be stabilized because the camera actually stabilizes the video for you. Um, and it basically will hover in position uh, based on the GPS satellites. And you can also set up waypoints so that it'll fly a waypoint mission for you and return to home uh, automatically without you having to touch the sticks at all. Uh, it's a very cool little toy. Okay, thank you. And uh, how often do you use it? Uh, I fly it as much as I possibly can. Uh, the batteries uh, basically in the back here comes with a uh, battery pack that goes in the back. Uh, it takes about an hour or so to charge the battery pack. and. Uh, um, depending on weather conditions, you can and, and you're flying, uh, how hard you're flying and wind and things like that, uh, you can usually get uh, about 20 minutes or so out of each battery. Um, it will go at full throttle. Uh, if you're going full throttle forward, it will go up to 50 miles an hour. Uh, so it does move out pretty good. Okay, well, thank you very much. Thank you. This is a DJI Phantom 2 quadcopter being used at Highland Hill Farm to help us show you our trees and shrubs that we sell for screening and privacy. The quadcopter is a great tool for us. We can evaluate trees and shrubs at distant fields without having to travel with a vehicle. It has a long range and we can set it on a pre-programmed flight path. It's fairly easy to use and it provides a lot of detail to us about our nursery stock and how well we're doing in maintaining the trees and shrubs that we sell. If you need trees or shrubs for security, please call Highland Hill Farm in Fountainville, PA. We specialize in trees and shrubs to block quadcopters. Yes, quadcopters are our specialty. So give us a call at Highland Hill Farm, 215-651-8329. Thank you. This video is brought to you by Highland Hill Farm. We grow and sell screening and buffering trees for privacy and sound barriers.